hello it's only me again and it's monday morning and i just kind of thought well actually it's afternoon right now i didn't wake up till like 11 o'clock but let's not mention that um i'm gonna just do a quick uh go through all the question the quick questions that i had on um comments on my post i did a couple of days ago um i've written them all down in my book i've got 20 questions thank you to everyone Pawaldi, pama om acharya prasad anupam sachin rich dixon uh Farksana, um, Avinav, uh, literally Rajesh, Arjit, Jimmy, every, literally everyone who asked me all questions. Thank you so much. Um, okay, so let's go for it. How old are you? I am 25. I'm going to be 26 on the 15th of June. What activities make you happy? I love dancing and acting. Obviously, they're my job. They're my hobby. They are everything that I do all the time. And uh, I don't really have a lot else to me. Sorry. <laughs> Uh, question three, did you see a secret Mona Lisa? No, but I have seen the real one and it's lovely. Um, do you miss 21 Safaros shoot? Yes, I do miss it a lot. I miss everyone on the set. I miss everything about it. I miss the early mornings. I miss the hard work. I miss the whole thing. Um, question five, uh, which is your next series? I don't have any series coming out. Mm, no. Um, I just have films which I've shot which haven't even released yet. There's a couple. There's one film which um, I met the same sound engineer on another film that I just did this year and he said that he'd just finished the post on it. So it is going to release at some point, but we just don't know when. Um, there's another film that I shot quite a few years ago and that one still hasn't released yet. Uh, up in Sikkim we shot that, which was really fun and I really hope that that comes out soon. It's a brilliant storyline. I think they wanted to put it up for loads of festivals, so it might be that this, it doesn't come out this year because obviously festivals and things probably won't be going ahead. Um, so no series, sorry, only films, but um, I would definitely do another series for sure. Um, how to get a photo and autograph? Um, yeah, I just send me a message, send me a DM. I can just write it over the top of the picture and send it to you. Um, what do you long for? not a lot um I am actually quite happy I don't know what I long for I probably long for uh for lockdown to finish and for things to go back to normal again so I can fly back to India and get back to work just good people love happiness I have all of that anyway so I yeah don't long for anything um how tall are you I am five foot eight and a half to be exact but on everything, I always put five foot nine and I always tell everyone five foot nine because very often if I go to like a casting or something and they're like, how tall are you? And I say five foot eight and a half. They think five foot eight, they hear five foot eight. So then whoever I'm partnered with, guy wise, will always be like five foot eight the same, but then they end up being like just right here. And I'm just like, oh no. <laughs> so five foot nine, let's just tell everyone five foot nine. Um, do you have a secret place? Um, I do have a secret place. Um, okay, so I'll tell you my secret place. A little forest um, sort of down the road from where I grew up. It just helps me to like reconnect a little bit with nature and with my inspiration as a kid and why I'm doing what I'm doing. Okay, uh, next one. How are you? Hmm. I'm okay. I've just got a bit of a headache today, but we're pushing through that. So there we go. Um, next one. Corona is natural or man-made? Um, Abhinav, I literally don't really want to answer this, but I'm going to. I believe it's natural. I believe it's a genuine mistake. Um, I don't like to think of the idea of mass murder and stuff, so I'm, I'm assuming that, yes, it's natural. But obviously, there's always that part that's, like, unsure and sceptical but we'll leave it there. Um, next question, do you prefer dancing or acting? <laughs> That's a really hard question because I like both exactly the same. Um, I would not pick one over the other. If I had two jobs on the same day, one acting, one dancing, I'd be like, help me to do both. I wanna do both. Um, yeah, they're both amazing. They have their own challenges, but they're both, yeah, I wouldn't be able to choose between them. Um, how was the experience on Shivai? Um, it was great. It was it was my first ever Bollywood movie. I'd never been on a, like um, a set. 
I had been on a set before many times, but not a Bollywood film set. And we had a lot of like stunts going on and it was really fun. Yeah, they're all like a lovely team and yeah, yeah, really good. Um, next one, who inspires you? Oh, who inspires me? Where's my thingy? No, yeah. Sorry, it's got like um, tea stain stuff on it, but yeah. Marilyn Monroe. Why does she inspire me? Because I think she went through a hell of a lot, love-wise, marriage-wise, work-wise. I think that she probably has the most incredible insight into the industry as as real as it gets. And I would love to pick apart her brain. So definitely inspired by her. How she always managed to be so happy and kind of like okay in front of the cameras even though she was going through so much at different times of her life. I just think, yeah, amazing woman. Um, who else inspires me? My mum inspires me. Both my parents inspire me, actually. Um, they both got divorced and I sort of watched them fall out of love with each other. And especially my mum confided in me quite a lot. And I think watching them both go through that and now coming through the other end and being happy and having their own lives, I think it's really inspiring. I've definitely learned from them that, you know, whatever happens in love, you're always going to be fine. It's always going to be okay. And um, yeah, they inspire me definitely. Next question, when is your book releasing? My book is not finished. It's half finished and I've been working on it for about a year and I've been working like that's the problem that I've got is I normally just work on it when I'm inspired to work on it instead of working on it every day without fail so it could take a long time um it's much harder than what I thought but we'll get there next question what is your opinion of India Rajesh my opinion of India is that it is full of colour it is full of love the food is amazing there's it's like a whole world in itself you go north and it's cold you go south and it's really hot you know it's just like there's so much to it and so many different little mini cultures within it I just can't get enough of it and and yeah in I love it although there's some darker parts of my experience there which I will talk about in one video at some point um in general it was and is a very loving place as a country I just think it's probably the best country in the world but I haven't been to that many places so next question what do you like most in a person um I really just like happiness I like somebody that's really fun and that can like just show me a really good time and I can show them a good time and you know anyone who's really fun I'm up for you know um being friends with because that's what life's about at the end of the day. Next question. How you learned cooking? From Jimmy. <laughs> Funny question. I cannot cook at all. Um, I'm always getting the wrong amounts. I'm always doing it, like leaving it in for too long and it ends up being completely burnt. I've set ovens on fire. I've set flapjacks on fire. I've thrown things out the window that are just terrible. Honestly, I'm just a disaster and I don't think anybody should trust me in the kitchen, but I will always give it a go and hope for the best. So <laughs> final question, question 20. How many boyfriends have you had? Um, I've had four boyfriends in my whole life. Um, will, Joel, Zach and Joe, and all of them have been brilliant, really good fun. Um, love them all to bits and still like fr relatively friendly with all of them. Um, and yeah really enjoyed all my fun memories with them. Definitely wouldn't change anything for the world. So that's all the questions, 20 of them. Thank you to everyone who asked them and um, have a great day.